You guys ever looked at yourself in the mirror naked and thought, I shouldn't be a lady footlocker. <laughs> I need to take this to the food court so everyone can enjoy it. <laughs> I was at the mall, I was buying myself a smartphone. Everyone's got a smartphone these days, you know? I think my phone's too smart. My phone stole my girlfriend. <laughs> yeah, caught them in bed together, had the, the back light was on, Pandora was playing smooth jazz. <laughs> that son of a bitch was on vibrate. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay being single though. I mean, I get to hang out with my dumb friends. My friends aren't dumb. I was talking to one the other day, and he didn't know what a juggernaut was. I couldn't believe it. I was like, really? You don't know what a juggernaut is? It's obviously it's an astronaut with big boobies, right? <laughs> I'm a moron. That's the, same, that's the same guy who comes over to my house and, and he goes, dude, your furniture's gay, bro. I was like, I happen to know this is a heterosexual. When we were kids, you know, we all used to ride our bikes around all the time, but my family was kind of poor, so my first bike only had one training wheel. <laughs> so I got really good at riding clockwise. <laughs> like, hey, you want to go over and play baseball at Billy's house? Yes, I do. Wait, are there any left turns? Because <laughs> if there are, I can't go. <laughs> See, some of you guys are drinking. That's great. I came up with a drink. It's actually got light rum. Dark rum and laundry detergent. I call it a Mai Tide. Get you drunk and fresh as a spring meadow. Some people are, are doing bath salts, they're snorting bath salts to get high. Is that crazy or what? The police think it's only among low IQ people because last month 32 people drowned. <laughs> uh, I came up with a good idea. I, learned, I figured out how to win the lottery better. Because every once in a while you see someone won the lottery, but then like four states over someone else had the same number, so you gotta give away half of your lottery money to some stranger. Ah, uh, screw that. Here's what I do. I buy nine tickets with all the same numbers. That way if someone else has those numbers, I still get 90%. <laughs> It's my money. <laughs> you ever notice how uh, every time a cop pulls you over, they say the same thing? They're like, do you know what I'm pulling you over? It's like, shouldn't one of us know? <laughs> I'm a bit of a smart ass. Last time I got pulled over, he was like, do you know why I pulled you over? So I said, because I'm riding on four donuts. <laughs> no. Because I run a brothel out of my backseat. <laughs> no. Because you've gone mad with syphilis? No, you killed four people last year. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> right about then I thought I was in some trouble, but I'm white, so he let me off with a warning. <laughs> sounded racist. I'm not a racist, I swear. They used to have a job where I think like, you can learn a lot from people of different races and cultures and stuff. You really can. Stuff you didn't even realize you didn't know. I used to work with a bunch of um, African American people. I was the only white guy. It's cool, I learned a lot. For example, did you know there's two F's in the word bathroom? <laughs> Used to be a saying, you know, you could say to your kid at night, you could say, Good night, sleep tight, don't let the bed bugs bite. Yeah, it was real funny until the entire country became infested with bed bugs, right? <laughs> now it's more like, Good night, keep your mouth shut tight. <laughs> Those bed bugs will get in there and harvest your organs. <laughs> Sweet dreams, Jenny. <laughs> you guys are fun. I'd like to stay and hang out more, but uh, I have an early morning job interview at Lady Footlocker, so I gotta go. <laughs> Thanks a lot.